What's up guys, Steven Moctezuma here, and I want to show you right now a clip of the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit in action. Now me and David just returned from North Carolina and we met a man by the name of Mark. And Mark had a crazy, crazy story. Um, but in that story, he was diagnosed with skin cancer way, way back in the years that was very debilitating on his body. And so I want to show you this clip of the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit moving in his life in an amazing way. I hope you enjoy this clip. All right, so I'm sitting here with uh, Mark Holmes, uh, young man that goes to our church here in Wake Forest, North Carolina. It, uh, our church is called Life Church, uh, Praise Chapel Christian Fellowship. And uh, I've known Mark for many years, known his family. Uh, it's been a long time that we've been together in and out of our, he's been in and out of, our, of my life and I've been in his. And, but here recently, God has really been doing some amazing things in his life. But uh, Mark has really struggled with a lot of physical ailments. And Mark, what, um, you know, what, what started all this off with the physical stuff? In 2006, I was diagnosed with squamous cell carcinoma. It's a form of skin cancer. It was in my tonsil, right tonsil, and lymph nodes. And the option was to take, cut it all out or cut some of it out and radiate and chemo the rest. So that's what happened. And the radiation destroyed all this side of my face okay. and this side of my neck. Okay. And all that tissue so, and so, bone. They, so, so, so it destroyed all that. And, and so it was gone. It, it's, it's, gone. it's gone. It was gone. So they, they had to move some muscle from your shoulder area. But Is it started right? with my leg. With your they leg. They cut the bone out of my right leg. Wow. And took muscle and tissue out of here and replaced all that they could in here, in my neck. Well, that busted. Then they had to do emergency, what they call okay. a pec flap. So they took my chest muscle out. Yeah. All that chest muscle, which is gone. Wow. And Moved it's it here in my neck and, and now. So now when they did that, that left you with a, di a, a disability of not being able to really lift your arm up. Okay. Not at all. And so that takes, so, so your left arm, no problem because all the muscles are there. Yeah. But right arm, right shoulder, they moved them so you didn't have no more. So what, what happened is we had Evangelist David Hernandez come. Uh, and uh, uh, he came on Sunday night and we had a, 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 an awesome uh, encounter with the Holy Spirit. And, and uh, Evangelist David called Mark over and began to pray for you, did he not? Yes, and, sir. And I, I was, it was so awesome because I heard David say, Evangelist David say, I felt something. He said, I felt something. And then you, before, how far could you lift your arm about? Maybe right here. I had about like this. Yeah, I noticed before range. in I church. I could raise yeah. up and I could, now I can put them together and pull it up. <laughs> But now, but you I couldn't do it by it. itself. You no. couldn't do it by itself, just like now that. Now he's doing it. <laughs> and so when David heard uh, said, "I felt something," I believe, and I, I truly believe ah. this. And and he's here's your proof <laughs> is that that muscle was placed there by the Lord, by the Holy Spirit, gave him new muscle, and instantly now can, with no help of his left hand, can lift his right hand, no problem, to praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And, we just wanted to make this video for uh, Evangelist David and anybody who wants to uh, view this video. Be encouraged. The Holy Spirit is still in the operating mode Absolutely. of healing and miracles are still happening today and they're going to continue Great. to happen. And here's a, a shining example of that miracle. God bless you and have a blessed day.